Hello friends, these are my semi-automatic rifles. Some people call them battle rifles. I really don't call them battle rifles, although that sounds pretty cool. And they certainly are made for battle. Made for a lot of fun too. Anybody who follows my channel knows that my collection changes quite a bit. But I have a feeling these four rifles are going to stay with me for a while. I have a fondness for each and every one of them. Well, let's go through each one individually and I'll let you know a little bit more about it. Here's my AR-15 and 223 and 556. DPMS upper, New Frontier Armory lower. The stock on there is the CAA Command Arms Armory. Has a magwell grip. The sight is a Bushnell Trophy, 1x32. Magpul handguard and angle foregrip. Love this gun. Here's my AK-47. It's a Romanian SAR-1. And if people ask me what is going to be your bug out gun, if, if, if things get crazy, which one are you grabbing? You're looking at it right there. I'm grabbing my AK SAR-1. I've got a 30 round magazine. also have 40 round magazines. The gun is simple. It operates. It never has failed on me yet. The round is a 7.62x39. Very tough, enduring round. And this is it right here. You're looking at my bug out gun. If things get crazy, grab my AK. Here's my Ruger Mini 14 Tactical. You are looking at a combination of the toughness and durability of an AK-47 with the shooting precision and accuracy of an AR-15. This gun is in 223-556. The grip, the stock, the side charger all function well together along with the trigger group to be an outstanding gun. I've got a Bushnell Trophy on there and this gun it just runs and it feeds anything you put through it. The toughness of an AK, the precision of an AR. Right there, Ruger Mini 14. Here is the GSG 522. GSG is German sport gun. Aesthetically, this gun is just real cool, real cool to look at. Have an aftermarket stock on there. The barrel looks like a suppressor, but it's actually just a barrel cover over the actual barrel itself. Magazine holds 22. I have a sight mark holographic sight on there. It's pinpoint accurate. It does well with the 22 ammo. Does cause some malfunctions every now and again, like most all 22s. And I know a lot of you guys like your Ruger 1022s, but for me. It's this GSG 522. A lot of fun, and I really like the way it looks, too. Well, these are my semi-automatic rifles. Some people call them battle rifles. I just call them a whole lot of fun. I'm interested to see what you have. Thanks for watching, and you guys be safe.